students in this video we will learn how we can change levels in scratch so let's get started to do that we need to make we need to paint our own sprite for that i'll just take my mouse over to the sprite i'll click on paint i'll just paint a random sprite a small object i'm just taking a circle you can make anything here you can make a square or any object now i'll name it as dot all right now i'll go back to code now i have this small circle named dot i'll decrease its size even more like 10 so it will be almost invisible now what i'll do is i say that when this cat is touching this small dot i should change my level to level 2 right for that what we're gonna do is to keep a track of the levels we'll make a variable so we'll go to variable we'll click on make a variable we'll name the variable as level and we'll press ok so now in the starting it should be zero so we'll write a code that whenever green flag is clicked our level should be zero so we'll set the level to zero now this cat should be touching this uh, object which is the dot so now it should move right so to make it move we write the code so we'll go to events we'll say when space key is pressed from space we'll just select right arrow so whenever right arrow key is pressed we'll go to motion we'll drag and drop point in direction 90 so 90 direction is the right side so it is pointing in the right direction and now we'll make it move some steps whenever we press the right arrow so now we are able to move it with the help of arrow key. now we write the code whenever this you know cat is touching this uh, you know small dot what should happen so what we'll do we'll wait until it is touching this dot for that what we will do is we'll go to control from that we'll drag and drop wait until so wait until it is touching the dot so we'll go to sensing to sense that and we'll drag and drop touching mouse pointer from mouse pointer we'll select dot now it will wait until it is touching the dot once it have touched the dot what we will do is we will change the level to level 2 so to do that i will go to variables i will drag and drop change level by 1 so 0 plus 1 is 1 so from level 0 it will be changed to 1 so let us see how it works when i press green flag when i take my cat closer to this dot what happens basically is level is changed to 1 right so this is the code now let us make it more perfect all right so i'll just add a backdrop in the starting let's say this is the first backdrop all right so i want at level zero this is the backdrop so i'll set that so i'll go to looks i'll drag and drop switch backdrop to backdrop one i'll click on backdrop one and i'll select baseball one now i'll go to dot I'll say whenever we press green flag, I'll take a forever loop because we're gonna give a condition and we're gonna check this condition forever. Now, what we will do is we'll give a if then condition. We'll go to operators and we'll just, you know, compare our level. So I'll say if my variable level contains one, then we should change the backdrop. So I'll click on backdrop. I'll add one more backdrop. Let us say I want to add the backdrop of bas uh, you know, basketball too. So now just see what we will do is if the level becomes 1 from 0 it becomes 1. What we should do is we should go to this basketball too. So I'll drag and drop switch backdrop to basketball too. Now just see I'll click on save now. I'll press the green flag. So now whenever I am touching this dot, so it is taking me to level 1. From level 0, it is taking me to level 1. So this is how we can switch different different levels. You can add any number of levels up till any. It can be any number, right? I hope you found this video useful. Thank you.